Before she would experience all the goals and the glory, Dana Castellanos was just a little girl from Maracay, Venezuela, with an undeniable passion for the sport of soccer. I played football at los cinco años, when I tenía cinco años. Entonces, la verdad, no me acuerdo mucho de cuál haya sido mi primera memoria, pero seguramente fue haciendo goles. Dana's love for the game made her a standout player from the start. Her talent quickly landed her a spot on the U-17 Venezuelan national team at only 14 years old. It was at the 2014 FIFA U-17 Women's World Cup where she made her mark, winning the tournament's Golden Boot Award after scoring six goals and leading her team to a fourth place finish. I mean, at that time, she was probably 15 years old when I saw her play. and. Uh, um, you know, she ended up graduating from high school at quite a young age and starting college quite young. I mean, even now as a senior, she's still only 20 years old. So um, I think that um, it was clear that she was a, a very special talent and uh, had great potential. Two years later, Dana was representing Venezuela yet again at the U-17 Women's World Cup, where she scored this wondrous goal against Cameroon that made headlines all over the world. My compañera me pregunta que qué hacía y le dije solamente dame la pelota y al verla al cuando pateé y ver que la pelota iba en tan buena dirección solamente empecé a correr para celebrar porque ya sabía que iba para adentro. After scoring five goals in the tournament, Dana was invited to the Best FIFA Football Awards 2017, where she was awarded third place in both the Best FIFA Women's Player and the FIFA Pushkas Award for the best goal of the year, all at the age of 18. She was there amongst some of the biggest names in the soccer world, like Messi, Ronaldo and Neymar. Fue un sueño hecho realidad. Siempre me esperé estar en 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 esos premios, estar junto a todos esos ídolos que que he seguido desde chiquita, pero nunca nunca me imaginé que a los 18 iba a estar ahí. After the World Cup, Dana came to Florida State for her first season as a Seminole, where she scored seven goals in the 13 games she was a part of. The following season, Dana continued to improve her game as she finished the season with 19 goals second in the NCAA and the second most goals in a single season in FSU history. I think that uh, on the field, her ability to read the play and um, um, spray the ball around, share the ball with her teammates, uh, the, the best compliment I can give to any player is that they make their teammates better, and Dana does that. Last season, Dana's 10 goals and 8 assists helped lead the team to their second national championship in school history. In typical Castellanos fashion, Dana provided the game-winning assist to Dallas Dorsey in the championship game to win 1-0 over North Carolina. Ganar el campeonato con FSU fue un sueño hecho realidad también, por supuesto. Siempre fue mi mi meta ganar no uno sino todos desde que estaba acá, pero ganarlo y ver lo complicado que fue y y hacerlo con mis mejores amigas, con el mejor cuerpo técnico del país, eh, sin duda alguna entre las mejores cosas que me ha pasado en mi carrera futbolística. Now in her senior season, Dana has a chance to end her career at FSU with back-to-back -back championships. It'll be quite the challenge, but if there's anyone who can do it, it's Dana. I'm Luis Pesualdo for Knowles All Access.